What is SODIS? SODIS is solar water disinfection, which is a water treatment method that has been known for more than 30 years. It is an appropriate household water treatment that is simple in application and relies on local resources and renewable energy. So this is a technique that uses solar UV radiation and temperature to treat water. It improves the microbiology quality of drinking water by inactivating pathogens that can cause some disease. At the same time, it does not change the taste of water. Why is so this important? So this is important because lack of clean water causes many serious health hazards and lead to a high risk of waterborne diseases such as cholera, diarrhea, typo fever, hepatitis A, and other diarrheal diseases. Moreover, one of the important statistics is that at least one third of the population in developing countries has no access to safe drinking water, so about 4 billion cases in diarrhea per year, out of which 2.2 million cases end in death. Precautions. Make sure that the material used to make the bottle does not prevent UV light from reaching the water. So this efficiency depends on the physical condition of the plastic bottles, so if it was heavily damaged it should be replaced. Water bottles need to be left under the sunlight for a proper length of time. Challenges that face sodas. First, sodas is not effective against chemical contamination but specific to microbial contaminations doesn't sterilize the water and certain risk of contamination and consequential infection remains. Water can be sterilized by boiling. In addition, sodas is not effective with bottles with low UV transmittance, old, scratched, blind and colored bottles. Second, this technique does not change the chemical water quality and it is not useful to treat large volumes of water. Moreover, so this requires suitable weather conditions since it depends on the sunlight, so if the sky is cloudless or up to 50% cloudy, bottles should remain outside for 6 hours. Yet if the sky is more than 50% cloudy, it should remain for 2 consecutive days. And in days of continuous rainfall, so this does not perform as good. Third, the technique is more efficient in water containing high levels of oxygen because sunlight produces highly reactive forms of oxygen in the water that react with the cell structures and kill the pathogens. Finally, water treated using this technique should be consumed within 24 hours to avoid the possibility of post-exposure regrowth. Sunlight creates reactive forms of oxygen-free radicals that contribute to the destruction method of the microorganisms. The Royal College of Surgeons is trying to achieve a goal, which is to advance the healthcare and the well-being of the people in the worldwide participating in community and educational programs. One of the overseas programs was so this water program. Professor Kevin McQuigan with his team visited a variety of schools and villages in northern Tigra to introduce the idea of sodas to treat their water. One of the problems they face is that the people doubt the method because of the color. Even though it's scientifically proven to be healthy because all the bacteria and the viruses are inactivated by the solar energy. To convince people, Professor McQuigan and his team partnered with local organizations in the community as aid agency, health department, and local clinics. In conclusion, sufficient water, quantity, and good quality is essential for life and no access to good quality drinking water leads to a high risk of waterborne diseases. Solar water disinfection provides a simple, uh, efficient and sustainable drinking water treatment option. Also it reduces healthcare associated with the consumption of contaminated drinking water. Some of the types of diseases that were reduced by sodas are the infectious diarrhea. There were a reduction of 24% of severe diarrhea among children of families that use solar disinfection of drinking water. Dysentery and cholera. Children below 6 were 8 times less likely to contract a cholera diarrhea. Solar water disinfection removes 99.9 .9 of the bacteria and viruses and also 
removes parasites to a certain degree from contaminated water. So this is required to prevent the population without access to safe drinking water from illness and death.